All right, of course, you're waking up to a brand new day. If you're just waking up, you're late, definitely. And we definitely are making you as well late for work because you definitely can't get out of the house, can you? Well, but indeed, if you have to, we're still streaming live on www.gh1tv.com. This is GH Today with your TV Royals. My name is Beiswa, and I'm here with your Ken Calf. Still to come on the show, News Extra with AJ Sapong brought to you by MTN. But happening now is a very interesting conversation with... Like two of my favorite persons. All right, so <laughs> two of them, they not too long ago were unveiled as ambassadors for women's football. And um, they have since been, you know, working towards raising funds, not just raising funds, but as well building or whipping up enthusiasm in women's football. And I hope that Kafu begin to watch women's football, you know, very soon. Yes, I With will. them in charge. Yes, I will. All right, but this morning mm -hmm. they're here you know, with a different message. We're talking SN Media Learning Tree and our guests, Nana Abba and Namwa, our very own um, ACE broadcaster, award-winning, and of course, um, lawyer and TV personality, Sandra and Kopia. Good morning, ladies. Good morning. Good morning. First of all, Sandra, let me ask, who or what are you wearing? <laughs> okay, so my Typical. jacket is um, from Christy Brown. Christy Brown, yes. Ghanaian? Yes, Ghanaian. Yeah. Oh, okay. yes. Of course you know Christy Brown. You should know Christy, Christy Brown. Brown. Why are you assuming oh. that we know what you know? <laughs> and, um, <laughs> Christy Brown is very popular. She is. She yeah. Yeah. And um, the dress I picked up from some store around. Yeah. The shoes are Saint Laurent. Saint Laurent. Yeah. Mm. Okay. Formerly YSL, East Saint Laurent. Mm. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. All right. Mm. I didn't even know they had changed from <laughs> YSL. <laughs> Ro, that's my sister. Really? I call her Ro. Yeah. Oh, Rose. Yeah, Rose, Rose. 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 But you had my Rose son Mund. called me. Yeah. Rose, yeah. <laughs> Rose listen, I, I know Kafi wants to start with some football I know. conversation. He can't wait. Listen, um, <laughs> it's good to have you here. And good we're to glad. be here. I'm, I'm, be I'm interested here. in this SN Media Learning Tree business. But just quickly, just a little bit of sports. I mean, this weekend, there's a lot of sports. What did you enjoy most? What did yeah, you enjoy you're most? You're so boring. Definitely you the finals you of many. Did I, did I <laughs> most? Take that one. Uh, over the weekend, of course, Andy Murray uh, won uh, tennis. I was very, very happy for him. It's a second. Um, Serena Williams, I um, mean, no one thought she was going to lose. Legend. Ag yeah, against Angelique. I mean, it was a damn deal already. Mm -hmm. Um, Portugal, France. I, I, I was, I was actually caught up between the two countries. France needed some upliftment, mm. considering what they had gone through in the last few months as mm. far as terrorism was concerned. So mm. they needed something, you know. But I think coming to the final, the whole country was united. They forgot about their problems. For Cristiano Ronaldo, it was from agony to ecstasy, and so uh, both of them, both teams, had something to celebrate. And for uh, him, I think it's one of a, uh, uh, Lionel Messi. Mm. Uh, for those who enjoy the debates between Messi and Cristiano Ronaldo, this is, this, this is one. <laughs> He's won a continental this is one, one now. over Messi now. So yeah, yeah. both uh, uh, teams I think deserved it. Mm -hmm. uh, Cristiano's team shaded it. Shaded it. Mm -hmm. I mean, they, they I took was losing more for fans. You were. Think. How yeah, come? For the black guys? Yeah. Um, oh, no, no, not so much because they hosted. It felt like an Afcon though. No, but but the, but the the Portuguese team also, also had, has yeah, a lot of there were a lot of black people yeah. on that field, yeah. field yesterday. And they've done well consistently yeah. throughout mm. the tournament. They, they had won a lot yeah. of their games. Mm. I mean, Portugal. Uh, All right, ladies. Exactly. Yeah. So uh -huh. Maybe they peaked with Germany. More. But there's France a lesson. Yeah, there's yeah. a lesson to it mm -hmm. that sometimes in your little corner you are not fancied, mm -hmm. mm. but you can step out. And make it make really it big. Like yeah, you know, happen. they were the unfancy team. They, yeah. they came out as the prom yeah. kings. Wow. And you know what I realized yesterday? That the Portuguese and the French benefited most from Africa's resources during the slave trade. One time. And they had more Africans. Yes. Yeah. Indeed. I mean, it's, it's it felt like that. That's I mean, but it was it wasn't very exciting. No, it wasn't. It was quite boring. boring. The, the Portuguese coach said, well, he, his dream was for his unfancy team to win. Mm. To win. And he did it. And Cristiano, legend. I mean, if you listen to the goal scorer, he said before he came on the pitch, Cristiano mm. told him that you are going to score the winning One goal. One time. Yeah. And I, 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 you know, when you saw him on the touchline, he was like a manager. <laughs> like a coach. And he has said that he will never consider managing any team. You know, but I think if he goes on to watch he what may. he did he on the pitch. Yes. And he has a credential, so you've won European, yeah. you've won all these, the Prophet well, of Marjana, Portugal. Marjana. All right, okay, enough of sports <laughs> talk. Enough of sports talk. Sport <laughs> talk. Yeah. Sandra, tell us about SN Media Learning Tree. Right. So I, I haven't heard Media Learning Tree anywhere. Mm. Well, Ever. why am I not surprised? Mm. Ever? Mm. No. Oh, there are I mean, facilities. journalism, that, mm. uh, you know, media, school, yeah, you know, exactly, that kind of like thing. Exactly, like I was saying, we, we are different. I know. <laughs> I'm not surprised. But tell us about it. Right. So 
basically, um, it's a facility where we're looking to train um, people who aspire to um, have a career in the media. Um, it's more practical training. I mean, I know there are a lot of schools around that actually you can go to if you want um, a career in the media, but they are doing mostly the theory um, aspect of the training. What we are looking to do is to train you, prepare you practically. Um, we're going to have um, award-winning seasoned broadcasters who will be doing the tutoring, so you know that you're assured of getting proper, hands-on, experienced people who are going to take you through um, the training. And um, basically, that's what it's about. What do you bring to the table, Sandra? Um, like I said, we're different. You, Unlike other, what do I bring to yes, the table? But that's media, yes. right? Um, there's a course that's um, called um, image consulting or branding. Mm. So I'll be teaching our trainees um, how to prepare themselves, how to look, how to conduct themselves um, as, uh, with regards to preparing themselves for a career in the media. I mean, you have to look the part, not just with a career in the media, but with anything else. So mm. I will be taking the image consulting class and preparing our trainees how to look and act right. Okay, and Nana? Nana? Well, um... What do you bring? I, yeah. Well, yes. everything. You are in front of a panel, so <laughs> tell us what you bring. Oh, really? <laughs> yes. You don't want to do this. Bring with us, me. what do you bring you, to the you table? Don't hey, you, you, you don't want to do this. We are not on stable for first. You don't want to do this. Young lady, did you hear you? You are in front of a panel. We are in front of a panel. Can you answer the question? Right now, madam. Can you answer the question? Can you answer the question? As she said, as she said, it's a whole program. Okay. News reading news anchoring, some people want to put it that way, news reporting, uh, interviewing skills, mm. and um, well, uh, w I will be taking people through news anchoring. Good. Uh, we I mean, have there's no one better when it comes to news anchoring in Ghana. Absolutely. I had to ask. Yeah. yeah. Well, yeah, looking for validation, I know. Yeah. I'm not looking for validation. I am she kind of stole a glass of me. Yeah, I, 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 I am oh, 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 oh. I am very sure. I, I am so sure of that. Yes. I am so <laughs> sure of that. That's a, that's a conversation we can actually have, you yes. know. Oh, no, 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 look, no, if no, I sat no, in your exactly. news anchoring class, mm. what would you be? be I, I won't tell you that because then you would not allow people to come to my no, school. No, just a sneak peek. Exactly. Come no, on. But I, and your competitors as well. Yeah. Ro, listen, knowing you personally, I know you're kind of, if not perfect, like close to being a perfectionist. And when it comes to presentation, mm -hmm. you know, there are a lot of things that you're looking at for pronunciations, Absolutely. you know, interview and skills mm -hmm. and, and, and all the things that I know that you would put mm -hmm. into your, mm -hmm. you know, your presentation, for instance. Mm -hmm. What informed this setup? Because I have sat through so many auditions um, for the past nine years. And I realized that there are people who come to the audition, they want to be news anchors and reporters. Sometimes they are confused. They're not too sure. They, they want to be news anchors because they think they've got a pretty face or they think they sound very well to themselves. Mm -hmm. um, some are better as reporters. Uh, some reporters would make better news readers, but they are confused. So sometimes they need coaching. Now, apart from that, they walk in, you can see there is something in them. They just need someone to ignite it for them. Mm -hmm. When you go into a newsroom, nobody has time for you. No one has time to pick you up, unless you're running into somebody like me, or her, or either of the two of you, mm. to say that, okay, I can see some talent in this young man or woman, and I want to take a personal interest in him or her. It doesn't happen quite often. So you realize that you go into the newsroom, you want to be a newsreader, you, you're put on air once, twice, you are shambolic and you're taken off air. And that is it, your dream is dead. How many people have you not seen on TV once, twice and they're taken mm. off and you don't see them again? It's a very competitive It's a very stage. competitive uh, stage. And so if you're not, you're not given the right training before you go into the newsroom or you're put on air, and it's happened so many times. I was lucky that the first time I went on TV, I wasn't so bad. And I have a spirit to keep pushing and pushing and pushing. But not everyone has the same spirit, especially for young ladies who really need someone to help them yeah. build their yeah. confidence. You're lucky. I bombed the TV3 auditions. When they yeah, came first. yeah, I, I heard. Said, no, I heard Charlie, he, was not not he was not good enough. He bombed me. You see, yeah. 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 I, never I, never bombed, I bombed myself. <laughs> yeah. So, you know, yeah, so that is what... there by then. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> you know, so that is what we, we are trying to do. That before you go for an audition, 
pass through our facility. Okay. Let us give you that training because at the end of the training, you're going home with a showreel. And I keep saying to people that for the media, you don't necessarily always need a certificate that I have a master's in this, I have a PhD in this, I have a degree in that. Do? It, it is, is your what ability. you can do. What is a showreel for somebody who is hearing it for the very first okay, time? Okay, so showreel. You come, we're going, it's six weeks and it's practical. We're and not it's doing intensive. any, it's, it's intense. We're not doing any theoretical training. So you're not coming in with a textbook. Tent, what is the media? No. The history of the media? No, we're not doing any of that. We have a studio in our classroom. So it is practical. You're sitting down like this. We're doing, we have a set for show presentation and we have a set for news anchoring. So if it is a show presentation you want to do, like Kafu and Base were right here, we have a set similar to the world, mm. not as gorgeous as this Thank one. Thank you very much. <laughs> <laughs> but, Lovely set. So we are taking you through, if, in fact, how to cross your leg when you're sitting on TV. That's why Madame Skanka is there. Told oh, she's my God. <laughs> Madame Skankani is there. You know, so, and then I am there to help you. How do you welcome your viewers? Sometimes you tune into a television show the content is great but the presenter is boring yeah. because Can hello mm -hmm. but in the morning yeah. there's a way of presenting a morning show yeah. there's a way of a mm -hmm. way of presenting an afternoon show mm -hmm. an evening show a midnight show but sometimes you think people are confused they don't know what they're doing you know so that is what we are trying to do prepare you practically so that when you walk into any media house it is not about whom you know it is what, what you, you know. have what you know sure. what you can and do there'll be evidence so, so at the end of these programs you know six weeks it's six weeks yeah. okay. uh, and, and um, if you like just run us through these courses once right. again so but before like, you go okay the news i was comes, actually going on the news the news comes oh up. okay well in 60 seconds <laughs> all right <laughs> <laughs> You know, <laughs> since they're calling themselves King Kaf and Queen since B, since they're calling we, themselves, we we should come up with a with a with a with a make a, with a take. What is it called? A, a banter? No, what is it? A oh, nickname? Kata, uh, you know. It's coming. Are, are you talking, talking about? Like they're just taking over. Are, are, are you talking about? Why are sitting in these two hot seats? Yeah. All right. Listen, just, ladies. I, I, I was coming to something. So. <laughs> yes, I was about to um, yes. tell you the courses that are available. Of course. So, yes. like Nana uh, rightly mentioned earlier, we have news anchoring, um, news reporting, TV presenting, mm -hmm. radio presenting, okay. Okay. Radio, we have, yes, well. interviewing yeah. skills will help you to sharpen your interviewing skills okay. and branding, that is the image consulting. Looks like and quite intense. It is. For six weeks. Is it yes. a, a daily affair? It's a, it's, a it's a daily it's affair. It's a daily affair. And times, times. You, you asked the question earlier about what sets us apart or what makes us different. Mm. One thing we forgot to mention is the tutors are actually people that you'll be seeing every day on TV or listening mm -hmm. to on the radio. Mm -hmm. So you know that you're getting the actual experience. Mm. I mean, these are people that after the class, you can go home, turn on your radio and, and listen there. to them. Exactly, they're and there. And you can, can pick identify up tips. What, exactly. Yeah. You can watch them on TV and then you can, you know, you can just kind of um, rehearse what you're doing. You know, just look at them and take tips. And they'll come in the classroom. This and sounds then, like such a great idea. It is. Um, it's fantastic. So Nana Yaore wants to know where he can find SN Media it's, Learning Tree. All right. It is in Kokomlimli. Okay. Uh, some like to call that area Nima as well. Okay. But it's in between Nima and Kokomlimli. border. Yeah. It's after the big Nima Gata. I mean, that's okay. my favorite. That's, yeah, the, yeah, that's, that's the best landmark. Just tracking. after yeah. the Nima runabout. Yeah. Mm. yeah just, you uh, go, drive down the road, mm -hmm. you know, the new town road. Mm -hmm. You go after the, right after the big Gata, mm -hmm. uh, there's a turn on the left. And then there are signboards there's that are will signboards that take you there. Listen. You see why Ghana needs to develop I know. We actually have know. a street name, yeah, but yeah, I don't think it's going to go that big We want the big gutter. number 26 Cotton Avenue. If you have Google but Maps, who knows? it will take you. <laughs> who knows? The, the big gutter should, should, should if be. I can, if I can ask, like if it. I can ask something quickly, mm. I mean, I've heard people ask, is the school accredited we don't oh, like to call ourselves a school is a facility okay. Okay. now um for those asking i just want to give them a bit of education on accreditation mm. the national accreditation board is there for mm. uh, uh educational facilities offering diploma degree okay. master's phd so certification, certification. Okay. okay when you're running courses like ours six week courses two week courses you know top up courses mm -hmm. you don't need accreditation because we're not giving you that kind of certificate we're just giving you a certificate of participation, participation. but what is the guarantee of quality well the guarantee this is the guarantee of quality mm. because you're getting quality training from mm. you know 
quality who tutorials, people who are already in the business. Okay. And really and, well, and truly, when uh -huh. you even go to the University of wherever, the certificate you're getting does not guarantee you a job. job. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so I was going to go there. So, so how does that as well guarantee me a job this is, in th this It you brings know, media me to the space. next question because we, we are very concerned. We want our, our facility to be totally different. Mm -hmm. So our top 10 students will be getting internships. We are going to make sure that these top 10 students are well are placed in media houses across the country. And this is 10 for every six 10 weeks? 10 for every, every six weeks. Okay. okay, so every six weeks. We'll 10, 10 students okay. for internship. Okay. Now, we'll make sure that three of them at least, at least get a job. We mm. are going to push for them because it's not that we are going to use our connections and say, Kafri, please employ this person. They have to justify their... You have to justify your, your, mm. your inclusion, okay. why you, you deserve the job and the placement. So okay. that is what makes us different. Because when you leave any other facility in this country, you're you're, the chancellor is not looking for a job for you. It is for you to go and look for your job. But we are going to be involved with our people and we are going to develop a relationship with our students. Um, should we call them the trainees? trainees. We, are going, we have a plan. We are going to develop a plan together. So it's like a family. And we'll be following your progress and we will be involved you do a story we'll call you you should have done it that way okay. exactly. so it's when continuous coaching exactly. even after the six Absolutely. weeks exactly. and Look, i'm imagining we are that I don't, we are coaching. Exactly. I don't necessarily have to have a communications background no for not no. at all to enroll no. No. Qualifications. in fact the minimum qualification is an shs um, certificate okay because we did this because somebody was asking why shs why can't they go to the university when i started my media job i had no degree i had nothing mm. i had just come out of senior secondary school mm. old school now senior high school mm. senior high school yeah mm. i i had nothing mm. i had nothing but yet i went to gbc i excelled mm. i went to tv3 my first four months i excelled without any certificate from any university so when you've left sss you can still do it and go to school some questions here right. hmm and when a Ghanaian says hmm you know something is coming <laughs> i auditioned with manaba and henry mom at tv three years uh, three years ago for news reading i was um, uh, yeah well years ago i was one of the finalists but i couldn't go through happy to see nanaba has turned up to be a great broadcaster you know that that, that audition there were mm. 600 of us mm. henry mom was the first to be auditioned mm. that was the last person to mm. be auditioned i was oh, 600. the first and the last mm, you got it. Yeah. how wow. much does the course cost a lot of people are asking that question okay it is thousand five hundred cities only for six weeks. For six, six weeks. weeks. And you get everything that you need. Everything. Intensive. You don't come in with anything. Payment you're plans. Taking, you're taking it's a one time is payment. Is there a payment plan? This is, the cost of, this is the cost of a plot of land in some areas. How, how, are, you, how are you sorting this Unfortunately, out? Unfortunately, there is no payment plan. No half down. And no, no, no. Full yeah. payment is full required payment before is required. the beginning okay. of the okay. full Because investment. it's only six weeks. So yeah, you're, you're not getting education in installments. Well, exactly. Including, including... Um, Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> uh, um, um, listen now. So the thousand five includes books, like... Yeah. The handouts that we'll be giving you, handouts. everything. I mean, the so showreel. One time, one okay. time payment. The showreel, everything. Facebook, uh, Instagram, Twitter. How, does people, how do people get in touch with you? Is there a telephone SN number? SN Media Learning Tree. Facebook, SN. SN. Okay. S as in for Sandra, Sandra N, N as for Nana. Nana. Yes. Media, SN Media Learning Tree. tree for all social media handles, Everywhere. Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, okay. yes. Okay. And uh, you can go to our website as well for more information. What's the website? www.snlearningtree.com. And our number, please. Yes, you know, drop the yes, number. I People take those numbers. numbers. Yes, the number yeah. is 0247 Again, Okay, please. I didn't that get is, that. If that I is 0247 Okay. okay. So you can call any time and we are happy to answer all your questions. There they go. There, of course, mm. there you have it. Listen, ladies, thank you. Just before you go, quickly, uh, uh, so what? You women's are. Football. What are you doing for women's football? Okay, <laughs> we're doing a lot for women's football because we realize that there is so much discrimination against our women. It's made them. Yeah. <laughs> discrimination. It is, it is true. And it is a deliberate discrimination. That is why you are serving as an ambassador now. A friend of mine was absolutely Mm. <laughs> That's it, absolutely. Um, fortunately, Unibank <laughs> just gave us 100,000 CDs last month. We're expecting Unibank. more money, expecting more money. By the end of the week, we are coming, to, coming out with a major announcement as well for our women. Okay. Uh, we want the, the era where the women were, are wearing men's jerseys to play. I mean, that, that is so insulting. Our women are wearing men's jerseys to play football. At some point, they have to rip up their sleeves because the sleeves... Is that not happening like elsewhere? Is it only Guinean? Well, we we don't 
don't care about, about elsewhere. What's happening elsewhere, but we're concerned we're about here. our women. Okay. We, we are what will this big money? What will this wow. big money do? This hundred thousand and the more that you're some expecting. of them are, 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 are haven't been paid since 2013. They're old bonuses. They're old bonuses. From so, you know, it is not their fault that they're footballers. This is what they want to do. There are some who will say, okay, so when you're sick, you trade beer. This is what they want to do. I mean, you cannot tell me that Nanaba, because you're not earning money as a TV presenter, <laughs> go and sell Willy. I'd like to sell <laughs> Willy, but this is my passion. This is exactly. what I want to do. And it's the same for these young ladies. Nana, come back next time with Sandra and come with some balls next time. Balls Football. Off. Okay, yeah, yeah, all right. You don't, want, you don't want to ask. Oh, like to do the total. Yeah, to do the total. Oh, I'm I'm very good at you. It. I want to challenge you. Oh, Shame, I'm very on good you. Shame on you. Shame on you. Coffee and his balls. Thank you very much. Coffee and his balls. Thank you. Listen. Thank you so much.